Hi, this is Thunder E from BorderWork.com and welcome to our tech and entertainment series. Today we'll be doing a video response to yesterday's news, I'm sure you all heard about it. Um, Epic, Epic who makes uh, Gears of War, the video game designer as well as the engine maker who make the Unreal Engine and especially the very famous Unreal Engine 3. Yesterday they made a uh, sort of an announcement through andytech.com who posted this news up and stated that they had just released and created Unreal Engine 3 on the iPhone for the iPhone platform as well as the iPod Touch. Now, this is very sad news as a Nintendo fan because for over the years, Epic has claimed that the Wii wasn't capable of running Unreal Engine 3 in any form or fashion, whether it be downscaled or anything like that. But yet, the iPhone, which is technically still on the pod compared to the Wii, has an Unreal Engine 3 engine. Sorry, Unreal, Unreal 3 engine. Apologize for that. So what does this what does this say? What is this, uh, what what are the implications here? Like I said, as a Nintendo fan, as myself, it's very sad news in the sense that uh, a lot of Wii games are suffer from poor development, also suffer from just lack of development tools as well as good engines. You know, the, the games can run off. There are very few games you can you can speak of other than the Nintendo made games that have good quality engines that they walk off. Unreal Engine would be a great you know resource tool. And in my mind, you know, this literally is an epic fail for Epic. You know, no pun intended there, but because they have missed a big opportunity here of actually. Uh, using this engine that they have basically downscaled or created for the iPhone platform for the Wii. I mean, no one's saying you should make Gears of War for the Wii. You know, we, it's that's not the market. That's not the issue. But uh, Wii games lack quality. I'm sorry. Wii games lack quality in um, quality in 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 design and make and use and all those kind of things. And this is where Epic can easily come in and you know, have this engine out there to create, you know, to, to sell to different, you know, third parties so they can make Wii games. I mean, strictly on a business sense, we're not even talking about being fanboys or anything here, is that Epic, I think, is is slowly missing out on a very valid opportunity to have uh, a game engine that can, you know, be widely used across the board. And they have the, you know, they have the namesake to, to push this engine out for the Wii, which could be easily done. But again, you know, in, we know how Mark Rain is and how he claims and makes all his very wild and, you know, rambunctious statements. So, you know, who knows? I mean, uh, we will be at CES this year. The engine will be at CES this year. We be demoed. So I would love to take, take, take my hands on it and test it on the iPhone and see how it looks like. Uh, the videos are up on the website at borderwork.com. So you can check out the videos for um, Epic Set Engine for the iPhone platform. And uh, I would love to know what you guys think about it. You know, you can post a response on the YouTube page. Once you check out the video on, a, on our website, borderwork.com, you can make a video response if you want to. Uh, don't forget to follow us at Twitter at borderwork.com. Uh, subscribe to RSS feeds. Subscribe to our YouTube page. Just hit the, you know, yellow button. You know, it's quite easy. And um, this, again, is Thunder E from borderwork.com saying, always enjoy your entertainment. Thank you. Thank you.